Welcome back to another episode of Spy X Family. Last episode, uh, I think Anya took some tests. She studied with Anki. Finally, Yuri meets Anya and immediately he calls her a gremlin, a little imp. But they got along actually because Anya knew how to appease, appeal to Yuri. How is that? Just fucking simp for Yor. And then Yuri's like, oh my god, you're not a gremlin, you're a fucking angel. And then there was a part of... There was daylight. There was a budget twilight. Twilight's rival, kind of, I guess, not really. Some clown that's... I forget exactly which faction he's from, but... He, a lot of his, a lot of his, uh, his, his naming scheme is based off of Twilight, but also all, everything he does is not like Twilight at all. He just gets by luck, kind of fucks everything up, but somehow fumbles away to his success. I'm not sure if he's going to be a recurring character, but I thought it was actually pretty funny. Yeah. Last couple episodes has felt kind of aimless in a sense that where it's, what's the main plot again? But it's kind of like sprinkling in more interactions with Damien and we're going to slowly build towards that plot of getting into the Desmond family house, even though the parent is gone apparently because Damien, there's no point for him to come home. Why? Because daddy's gone. What the fuck is going on? I don't know. Maybe we'll develop more plot with this episode. Let's begin. Uh, so it's a enemy group. I mean, not a, it's a competitor company that's going down under because of the Desmond group, I guess. Good job, Anya. Anya didn't fail. That's, that's the main goal. My sweet Lloyd? Yeah, Becky is a... Uh... Becky is a... Uh... Becky and Lloyd, I... That's... That's, that's weird, man. Hey, look, Damien's over there. I... No comment. No comment. Oh. Wow. Did he just mess everything up more? <laughs> Is he trying to look cool to the boys? Rolling sweep. I don't know. It's got more dusty. <laughs> wow. It's actually... Wow. It's a little popular with the girls, huh? Mm. Study session. Anya, get in there. Becky is correct, but Anya, you gotta get in there. For the sake of the mission. Becky looked at Anya like, are you serious right now? You're better than that, Anya. Becky's a bit understanding. Oh, it's the kid. That's the kid with the parent. This company's going down under. Uh, what will he do? Damien, were you smoking cigarettes? <laughs> nice try, I guess. Huh? Wait! He got himself. He's pretty good actor, I guess. He punched me! <laughs> no, Anya, you're a witness. Anya, you're a witness. Testify! We got the boys, you know, being a witness, but one more person. Exactly. We need we need a third party. Here comes Anya. Oh. Second son would never do that. Look how she look how epic she looks. It can't be. Yeah, look at her. <laughs> Anya saved the day. Damien, you gotta invite us over for a study session now. <laughs> What? Did you see Damien blush? Yeah, that was pretty cool. That was probably one of the coolest moments so far. It actually might have. Look at Damien's face. No, no, no. Damien blushed pretty hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just say thank you. George, now you're kind of... You just... George! You just self-reported. This is a little bit too heavy for kids, huh? Like, yeah, this is more grown-up problems. But what George's saying is correct. What do you want Damien to do, though? Yeah? Is he using us? Is this gonna be like a reoccurring theme? Now we're just gonna get more stuff for him? All right, you got your juice. I love how Anya and Becky are still sticking around. <laughs> huh? Okay, so we're gonna get into Caviar Bowl too. Okay. This is the last day of school. How far is he gonna push this? 
I think Anya's reading. I even Beck is reading through his bullshit, even though she can't mind read. What's next? Baby's like, are you happy now? What else? Okay. Alright, have a Stella. Sure, why not? Yeah, what's next? Yeah, stop. He's right. What if this is all a misunderstanding? And like, his company's actually not going under. And everything's gonna be fine for him. And we did all of this shit for no reason. I mean, I don't think... I think we're getting baited. Okay. I mean... What is, what is we're also... Okay, we're gonna sing together, I guess. <laughs> Becky for real. <laughs> oh, Dave is getting into it. <laughs> I know for a second. I was like, Becky, are you serious right now? This guy's playing us. But, you know, if this is what helps, George, why not? It's just the song. But uh, I still feel like we're getting baited. I feel like George isn't gonna get expelled. I feel like all of this is just... Like, look at Anya in the... <laughs> Anya looks so suspicious of this. Take care, George. What is that? Damn. Damien looking kind of cool. Damien's... He's not a bad guy. Everybody's here. I don't know who any of these guys are, but... Wow, really? What's going on? Anya's giving a piece of leaf. <laughs> Anya, come on! I, I don't I don't believe this. No, no. There's gotta be... They've built up a moment like this. The only way for this to pay off is if everything George has been saying was actually not true. And he actually comes back to school the next day. And they're like, what the fuck? Give us our shit back. All right, let's see. Let's see how long this lasts. You got acquired. The company's trying to find a Desmond fucking bailed you out. In fact, you shit on Desmond. You shit on Damien when they helped you. And now tomorrow, he's going to show up at school and be like, oh shit, what am I going to do? All the kids are going to be like, the fuck are you still doing here? Oh, yeah, this is a little bit- everybody's looking at like a con artist now. Wow, really? You did all that just to, you know, prey on the other kid's kindness? <laughs> just- mm. Oh, Becky. Yeah, caviar bull too! On <laughs> <Anya>, the, the leaf. <laughs> it's alright. Poor George. I kind of feel bad though, because he's just a kid and that was just a misunderstanding. I'm just shooting on him for no reason, but Jesus. Wait, something important for school? You're over-exaggerating what's going on in her head? <laughs> Henderson would never do that. Henderson would never do that. But what did she forget? This is Rebel Anya? <laughs> he's gonna drop out and become a punk biker? You're superhuman, just run. That's gonna fall off. That's gonna fall off. Your catch it? Oh, it's her PE uh, gear. Yours gonna catch this, right? So fast. Like, oh my god. Like, relax. Is it gonna land perfectly on top and the granny won't even know it was there? God. Okay, okay. Just run to school, Yor. What's the point of waiting for a bus? Oh, oh, oh. She's parkouring. Oh, she's parkouring. Okay. Even better than running. It's just gonna just. <laughs> well, who runs like not like Spider Man, but uh, the the superhuman, the superhuman. <laughs> you don't have to hide like that, do you? <laughs> well, she can't afford to be seen by anybody, or else apparently I'm just gonna get expelled. Yeah, she is. Oh, you're is the mysterious spider woman right now. No, there she is right out the window. Yep, you saw her. Yep. It's spider woman. <laughs> you're drawing a lot of attention right now. Anya and Becky, right there, right there. <laughs> no, you just missed her. 
to your left, to your right. No. Huh? Hello. Her hair just like pointed up. Oh. Hello. What? There was no gym today. So you came here for no reason. It was all a misunderstanding. That's why she left it behind. Good job, you are. But the parkour scenes are very cool. It's okay, mom. Things are coming by. What are you doing here? Yeah, weren't you at the hospital? You liar. Okay, I did. And then, sure, sure. Uh, I figured out your plan, Lloyd, and I come to intervene. No. No, we just thought that Anya forgot her shit, yes. She's not a failure for a mother for coming here. <laughs> no, what? You're doing perfectly fine. Daddy and mommy going out for a date. Aww. Isn't this nice? Everything seemed very wholesome and happy recently. That's another episode of Spy X Family. Everything has been, again, just pretty just chill. We're just kind of in the peaceful times. But I wonder if this is like the calm before the storm. Because the beginning of part two, core two, shit popped off with the terrorists and the, and the and the dogs and the explosions and the ambassador, right? And after that, everything has been kind of just returned back to normalcy. Just doing, you know, school setting, more interaction with Anya and Damien. Still slowly building up towards something. But, ah, nothing from Anya's side though, right? Everything is, everything Anya does in favor of Damien, Damien kind of misinterprets it as some kind of romance that he seems to be falling for her, even though he doesn't want to, per se. But there's nothing from Anya to Damien, because this is all for the sake of the mission, right? So I wonder at what point will that change? Maybe soon, I don't know. Anyways, if you stick around this long, if you enjoyed my reaction, you already know what I'm going to say. Check out the other videos and playlists on my channel if you watch another video immediately after this one. It helps the YouTube algorithm push out my small channel to recommend so that I have a chance to compete with some of your favorite reactors. Until next time, guys, take care.